So I'm going to show you double running stitch. Double running stitch is a linear stitch and if you work it correctly it actually looks the same on both sides of the fabric so it's really handy if you're doing anything in 3D. And to start it off you're just going to do a run of ordinary running stitch. So bring your needle up from the back of the fabric, take it back down and then bring your needle up again the same distance away so that the, the distance of your first stitch is the same as the gap and then keep working your way along the line, keeping your stitches the same length. So the stitch should be the same length as the gap each time. And then when you reach the end of your row, when you come up this time, instead of continuing along the line that you're stitching, you're actually going to come back again. And so this time you're doing exactly the same thing, but you're going to fill in the gaps. So bring your needle up where your last stitch started and put it back in where the previous stitch ended and just keep doing that to fill your line back in as you go and so when you're done you've got a solid line of stitching which is very similar to back stitch but it looks the same on both sides of your fabric and you can see when I started my stitching I just caught that very first thread under my first stitch and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to loop my needle through that last stitch and create another stitch which I pass my needle under and that just creates a nice secure knot to keep my thread ends secure and I can trim that off and that gives me a row of double running stitch on the back which is the same as on the front and that is double running stitch.